My name is Kwejam Smuko. I work for Zambia Revenue Authority, Customs. I'm based at Nakonde, which is a border with Tunduma, Tanzania. So I'm working at the border with Tanzania and Zambia. Well, the message I've taken home, I've learned quite a lot from the presenters that uh, did the presentations today, especially on the single window. Uh, it's, it's a very good trade facilitation too, and we hope that we can replicate whatever experiences we've learned in our country, Zambia. Yeah, some of the challenges we face mostly it's uh, congestion at the borders due to poor infrastructure. As a result, trade facilitation is quite a challenge. Apart from that, uh, our staffing levels are still inadequate to cope with the trade volumes that are coming to the country. But basically, the most posing challenge like from the border I'm coming from Nakonde is actually the infrastructure. Uh, right now, what is happening is because of the uh, ongoing construction which is going on at the border, we are forced to share one lane with the Tanzanians, so we interchange the crossing times. The Zambians cross, Tanzanians traffic from Tanzania crosses in the morning, and then in the afternoon traffic from Zambia crosses to Tanzania. So we are by limiting the working hours at the border. The single window will address that challenge because right now we have fragmented uh, various government departments working at the border and each department has to scrutinize each and every declaration that is coming in. And from what I learned from the single window, if we can synchronize our operations and have one documentation, I hope that will greatly ease our processing efficiency. USA Trade Hub, uh, we already, they've, I would say they've already helped us by, by putting up the Joint Border Committee. But as I said, uh, on infrastructure, especially infrastructure at the borders, we would greatly appreciate if you sort of been coming on that one. The role of the private sector, those we got them as our partners in the execution of our duties. So the private sector, we rely on them since uh, uh, we have brokers and then we have these uh, uh, clearing agents. Uh, the private sector, we regard them as our partners as we try to, to, to streamline the clearance of the borders.